sometimes you have fears, you have beliefs, you have <laughs> memories that could then turn around and transform into something beautiful to take your relationship <laughs> to the next level. So you have to allow, you have to allow something that was painful to end up being something that you can laugh about because everything is not always that serious. serious. Most Quit of it, it is not of it all of it's serious. not just not that serious. Yeah, yeah. It's just not. And like when you when you I mean, I think I learned this the hard way in our relationship was that, you know, he would say, I'll be, I'll say something, he'll say something to me and then I'll be like, well, what about, well, what about this? And why does he, he was like, everything is not about you. Like everything is not, every time that I feel a certain way, it does not always have to be something about you. Like, why are you making yourself that important? When it was just the way he was feeling. Right. I didn't have, it wasn't anything that I did. It wasn't anything that I brought into the situation. It was just how he was feeling at the moment. But because I was so defensive, I'm just like, oh, what did I do? And what do I, what do I need to do? And he's just like, whoa, wait a minute. Everything is not about you. Right. Everything is not towards you. Everything is not from you. It's not, there is a world that I'm involved in. And I need you to understand that everything is not about you. And when you don't take yourself that seriously, then you don't feel a certain kind of way when they express something that may not be favorable. Right. Allow me to reintroduce, reintroduce myself. We never get stuck in repetitive patterns because they lead to lack of passion yeah. in a relationship. I mean, there's a great, it's like it's a funny thing because when you know me, you know what I'm saying? When you know me before I ask or when you do something before I ask uh, or because you know I needed it, it's extremely sexy to me. It's uh, it's so empowering to know that you were anticipating me or you were looking out for me, right? Because I guess something about my relationship or who I am is predictable in that sense. So it's like in that sense, it's beautiful. But then in another... Why are you looking like I'm just listening. In, in that sense, it's beautiful. But in another sense, when we're in a predictable pattern where you just know I'm going to do the same thing the same way all the time and you do the same thing the same way all the time, then that that same ingredients doesn't have the same level no, of passion. You don't, you know, you just like, oh, you on autopilot? And you'd be like, no, I'm not on autopilot. I thought that's what you wanted. What? Go ahead. You saying a bunch I mean, behind what you're saying. saying. Say what you're saying. I'm just saying. Say like, what you're saying. That very thing about pattern, understanding, looking at a person, and trying to anticipate what they want and things that they that they need. You start doing this. You <laughs> trying to act like you I'm ain't not. saying that. You saying something. When, say what you saying then. When, when they anticipate that, and she's you saying do that because I switch them. up because she always be And then they switch up, and then you just be like, I don't know what you. Oh my time. god, I don't, I don't even know. And so then, but your then arm I had missing. Your arm is missing. I had to like not take my self so seriously in that and in, in understanding that he is a human being that is evolving that he is a then person why do you get that, so mad when i when i because you be priding your you be like yes i got that pattern i bam before you even ask it i got it and then you be like nah i want that you be like i was working really hard and now i'm back to stage one we're not back in stage one we just didn't have a conversation I about what i was doing now so i learned over time if i'm giving up certain fools or i'm not going to do something to i'm changing the responsibility then i start going hey babe this month i'm not gonna eat bread because then you know i'll be trying to like not eat bread so i can lose weight and uh, and then she'll come in with all the hawaiian worlds all buttered up just laid there like here i made you some bread i made you some sandwiches I'm like, I don't want no sandwiches. Like, who? how am I supposed to know you don't want no sandwiches this week? Because I wasn't eating that this week. But if I failed to tell her in the evolution, then now the same thing in, in the repetitive pattern now ends up being something that could be a tension point. I us. was just about to say that we made sure that it did not become a wedge yeah. or a tension point. A growth we, opportunity. Exactly. You articulate it. Sir, I need yeah. you to let me know you're not eating bread this week, okay? Or this month or however the Lord is leading you. I need you to let me <laughs> know that and so and then, and then you know I'll, I'll, be, I'll make a joke a joke of it but it helps it i made sure that i did not allow that to be getting my spirit like oh so now he wants this and not i didn't let that it's just he's evolving and it's okay and i'm all right to rock with him because that's my husband and i love him and i want him to have the things that he needs to be successful and to and to be his support